The question is, who would win in a fight? Vi or Jinx? Vi. No holds barred. Nothing is off the table. This is complete shenanigans, complete mayhem. Who's getting the W? It's Vi. I don't know. If Jinx can have all the trinkets she needs, I think she'd do Vi in. I disagree. I didn't say hand to hand. I said fight. She has all the grenades. She has all the knickknacks. Yeah, but then Vi can have those busters. Yeah. And she can do the business. When she has those big gauntlets, it makes you think she could really come in and pound you, you know? Yeah. A real good fisting. Gotta do fact of the day though, right? Page number. <laughs> 145 fact number. One. Google earns $20 billion a year from advertising, more than the prime time revenues of CBS, NBC, ABC, and Fox combined. Now, that's gonna be far, far more. Where do people get their news? The interwebs. Hey, no render of the comic can. Not yes, and right now we're gonna be reacting to the trailer for Arcane season two. We have indeed watched the first three episodes and thought that the third episode was the best of the bunch. It was paced best, the story actually went somewhere. But I do feel like there's some type of double backing in Involved. People are not really going the direction you'd think they'd go and when they do they turn back and go back to the character They were even though they shouldn't be doing that or sometimes they triple back wait I feel like I'm in a spy movie like oh you 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 me who what with the rest of the season six episodes left We get some good good stuff and they end up tying up all the loose ends that are potentially there with these first three episodes With a nice bow as nonsense say does say let's get to this trailer. Let's go You were right This is where the boom happened. My hey, sister boom. is gone. There's only Jinx now. <laughs> I want to tear that laugh from her throat forever. I'm ready. <laughs> to return peace to this city, you must declare martial law. Topside is the real enemy. You have the chance to rally the Undercity together. You're a symbol. So what are you planning? To watch it all burn. Taking a leap forward means leaving a few things behind. This has to end. Then stop me. See, I would say they showed too much, but it was so discombobulated that I'm not sure they really gave anything away either. They gave us so many money shots. There was so much going mm. on and so many colors and it was so bright. But one thing that did stick out to me was that moment when Savika said to Jinx, you could rally everyone together. Mm. And they panned to this graffiti artwork of Jinx, but behind her was Vanda. So this is actually maybe Jinx pulling back some of Vanda's wisdom and bringing a little bit of powder back. I think there might be a time jump. They did that in the first season, mm. it worked well. I think it was one of the best versions of a time jump I've seen in a long time. As of right now, it's not particularly see-through, which is a good thing, but it can get confused very easily. It's pretty clear Mel's mother was the one who caused all the shenanigans when it came to Piltover and the memorial. We thought that she's doing something, she ended up doing it. And then she came in like the savior, and then Mel herself being taken by the Black Roses. That might be a play for her to understand what her mother's actually done and her trying to seize power in this way so she can basically try and take over the world herself. And it seems like Caitlyn's 
Ellen's ascension to becoming bad guy number three is part of her plan as well. Playing right into the plan, mm -hmm. unfortunately for Well, her. when you have that much emotion, that much anger as to the reason why your family is in the way it's in and people have been got, I understand it to a degree. But as a leader, maybe you need to be able to say, hey, pair it back. I need to disassociate my own vitriol here. Otherwise, it can cause bigger problems. That's true, but the story wouldn't run no. if that happened. No, that's why no one is perfect. That's just the truth. Some people think they are. They're fools. The reality is everyone's got to work on themselves and everyone makes mistakes. Everyone has those days. Sometimes you gotta pretend to be someone you're not. That's not always the best idea though, because that can lead to other problems. As shown with Vi and Jinx in this show. This just turned into a thesis over here. It turned into Hannah Montana knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we do here. We connect the dots, even where there are no dots to be connected. Just expect it, because it's unexpected.